Most people don't reach their dream, not because of failure. Most people don't live their dream because they give up. You see, it's not the failure that stops us, but that most stop at their first failure. Those who succeed don't stop at one failure. They don't stop at 10 failures. They don't stop at 100, 1,000, or a million. They say, this is my goal, and I will do whatever it takes to achieve it. I will learn the lessons from any failures. I will learn faster. I will work harder. I will work smarter. And I will not quit until my dream is a reality. That's the difference between success and failure. Failure makes winners stronger. Failure makes winners hungrier. But it makes most give up. It makes most feel worthless. Winners don't enjoy failure. But they would never let failure stop them. Next time you encounter failure, you got to remember every great thing on this planet is here because the Creator learned what did work, but learned more from what did not work. When we are kids, we don't stop at failure. When we first learn to ride a bike, it's failure after failure. We get knocked down time after time, but we get up and push forward until we achieve our goal of riding the bike. But then we get old and most of us get weak. We are too soft to get back on the bike. We come up with excuses. It must not be for me. No, you just soft. No, you just lazy. Tell yourself the truth. Get back on the bike. Learn why you fail. And make sure you don't fall again. Make sure you are stronger for having the lesson. Failure is not the end of your story. It is the start of your comeback story. If failure was the end of your story, there would be no greats. Greats like Jordan, greats like Einstein, like Edison, like Oprah Winfrey. If these people stopped at failure, the world would not be filled with their greatness as it is today. The only way you can call it a failure is if you quit. If you keep going, it's only a hurdle. One, you will overcome. The only way you can fail is if you quit. Never quit. Keep pushing. You will get there in the end. Failure doesn't exist in the mind of a champion. All it does is push them to a higher level. Are you a champion? Will you accept failure or keep going? Learn the lessons. Apply the lessons. Come out stronger than before and keep going. Some people feel failure so much they never try. They never even start. Some people give up right when they're about to succeed. They were so close, but they threw in the towel. Don't let that be you. Thomas Edison didn't fail. He found 10,000 ways that did not work. Guess what? He only needed one way that did work. Einstein said, failure is success in progress. Failure. It's just one more way not to do something. Keep going and you will succeed. Keep going and you will succeed. Failure is not the end of your story. It is the start of your comeback story. What's keeping me from reaching my goal although I put everything that I have into it? Am I just doomed to failure for the rest of my life? One of the things you gotta understand my friend, is that you're supposed to fail. You're supposed to fucking fail because failure is the stepping stone to success. It's not just cliche. You know, that sounds fucking nice. You put it in a Hallmark card, right? Failure is the stepping stone to success. Fuck that poetic shit. You need the logical reason why. Because failure is an experience that lends to wisdom that ultimately makes you a stronger version of yourself. Right, right now you want to play basketball. Well, it's not in the cards for you, but you know what you discovered? How to be committed, how to be disciplined, how to deny the self so that you can move forward in the direction of your dreams. You've won in that regard. The failure is just a signpost that you're going in the wrong direction. 
Do you understand? You are discovering something about yourself and you're exercising your character every time you get up and try something, move in the direction of something, even if you don't get the fucking thing. Failure is nothing but a lesson to the winner. Failure is nothing but motivation to the winner. Failure is fuel. No one likes to fail, but the difference between those that win and those that lose in life is the winner decides a better meaning for their failure. They decide never again. They declare, I will be better next time. Don't let failure stop you. Let it grow you. Let it develop you. Failure is not the end. It's just the start. The start of your comeback story. It's not about the thing. It's not about making the basketball team. It's not about making a million dollars. It's about what you learn along the way, who you become along the way. It's that fucking journey and you're on the journey. And guess what? The journey is hard. The journey is riddled with failure. And that's why most people don't do it. Most people aren't willing to get on that journey because they're afraid to fail. You, my friend, have failed. Congratulations. It's the greatest thing that ever happened to you because it shows that you're alive. It shows that you did something and it shows that you're growing stronger. Now go and fucking fail again, bro. I hope, I hope you guys that watch these videos, I hope you're gonna fail a thousand fucking times. Keep going in, out there and failing. You know what that means? Every time you fail, it means to me that you're doing something. Go out there and fucking fail. If you use failure as fuel, you can't really fail. If you use it as motivation, you cannot be defeated in the long term. If you use it to drive you, use it to make you, it can never break you. If you never accept defeat, you can never fail. Refuse to be defeated. Refuse to be defeated. Learn the lesson. Find a new path and a different way to your goal. There's always a way.